Hi folks, Buffin here from the Pillar Revolution. So the evidence is piling up that Netanyahu is to blame for the Hamas attacks. And this has been my instinct from the very beginning. And most people understand that he's responsible for the tyranny that's pushed the Palestinian people to violence in the first place. But well beyond that, there's a lot of more specific details. So my first instinct was that the intelligence failure, the idea that they didn't know the attack was coming, was highly suspicious or just completely unbelievable, really. And then, even worse, in a different way, the hesitance or the withholding of assistance to people. The people at the rave were there for three hours at least, and I don't know if they were ever even rescued or if the, the attackers just left, but it seems like for a country where everybody signs up in the military and they have a huge military, the military wasn't doing anything to help the people. And that becomes even more suspicious when you hear Netanyahu call it R-9-11, which just raises alarm bells um, as far as trying to exploit other tragedies and trying to exploit people's sympathies um, is really a disservice to the victims of both of these events um, to try to claim that in order to call for unity, which was also highly suspicious, calling for unity. So I had addressed all those things in my previous videos, but now even more evidence has come out. Of course, they've said that he doesn't... Uh, they, they did have advance notice, um, and it was unbelievable that America would not have any intelligence about this either, but they claim that, which, if they're lying about it, makes them res partly responsible. But apparently Egypt gave um, Israel advance warning three days in advance, and it's just terrible, and the only thing that really can be done at this point is to remove Netanyahu and hold him responsible for everything he's been doing to make it as bad as possible, specifically in order to try to destroy Gaza. And it's his goal that he's accomplishing unless before they invade, because then things keep getting worse, they remove Netanyahu and this message gets out there. So please help boost this message and spread the message any way you understand it so that we can stop this terrible tragedy from getting even worse.